let's have a look at my testosterone. My total testosterone was 618 nanograms per deciliter, and my free testosterone was 108 picograms per milliliter, both well within the healthy range for a male my age. Now, I know it's very trendy right now to quote unquote optimize testosterone, particularly with hormone replacement therapy or HRT. But it's important to note if you're feeling great, if you are strong, energetic, if you're recovering well, and your levels are within range, there's no evidence that HRT is going to improve things for you. What's important to understand here is that jumping on HRT shuts down your natural testosterone and sperm production, which of course can affect fertility, a pretty important point if you are someone like me that is wanting to have kids. Yes, it is true that there are medications that can help restart sperm production, but this is not guaranteed and there often are side effects. If you don't have clinically low levels of testosterone, it's it's not the first thing that I would jump into if you're low in energy, for example. I would workshop other potential causes for low energy or sexual function first.